Well, less terrible matchup in any case. Basically, any matchup. <laughs> any character coming up next would be a less terrible I matchup. I mean, Ryu's best matchup is probably Honda. Probably. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So, Ultra Combo, a.k.a. Uh, Anikatu, with old Sagat. Heads right over there. You know, he also plays new Sagat, and he's also really good with new Sagat. Oh, he's doing it? I was just messing around. But apparently, he's doing old uh, new Sagat. Huh. This is a match that Daigo knows really well. He's played a lot with Yaya. Yeah, in Japan, they don't play old Sagat as much because he's kind of soft banned. Yeah. Yeah, not literally banned, but he's like so good that most people don't don't pick him. It's like looked down upon. Yeah, same thing with like Vega wall dive tactics, but Mao has no shame. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was the best thing about like the X Mania. You still got to see Mao's personality really come through. Uh, oh, snuck in a little tiger shot. I like yep. these tiger shot timings from Anikatu. He's being very cautious about them, but then sneaking in little unconventional spots. Well, that said, all Daigo. Oh, oh it did hit all yeah, the way. Yeah, that's the problem of being in the corner. You that's don't slide true. back far enough. If you're not in the corner, you can actually get hit by the first one and block the rest. That's the guy. That's the guy, yeah, yeah. Nice hurricane to make sure it doesn't land on that fireball. So beautiful. Great positioning for the red fireball that caused the knockdown here. <laughs> a move that ever since they gave Ryu in this game, they're like, that was a mistake, and they never gave it to him again. <laughs> it's going to cost you EX meter to right. from now on. <laughs> exactly. So game one, Daigo. Now what will he do? New Sagat still? Old I'd Sagat like to maybe? see him go to old Sagat. Yeah, me too. It's his main. Just play your main, dude. Nope. nope. He's going to stick with it. You select old Sagat by selecting Sagat. And then there's a little up, down, whatever code up, that you have down, to Up, down, down, up. Uh-huh. AKA wiggle up and down. <laughs> you know what? Sagat's the only one I've memorized because he's the one everyone picks, right? And everyone keeps messing up. I don't understand it. I was like, it's up, down, down, up. Look, dude. Old Honda is one of my main characters, and I have no idea what the code is. <laughs> I just mash. Yeah. <laughs> A little bit better ranges now for Anikatu. See him not trying not to take uh, as many risks. Well, he was doing that before, but now it seems to be working out a little bit better. I wonder if he plays new Sagat versus Ryu because you can hit his hands a little further out that the super fireball becomes less effective against him. Oh, does that is it better for new Sagat than old Sagat? I don't know. See, I'm not I, sure. I, old oh, Sagat that was a disaster. Oh, oh there it is. Because Old Sagat, I still think, can get away from getting hit by one I and blocking so the rest. Yeah. yeah. I'm just trying to figure out why he's playing new Sagat. Like, you don't want to go easy on Daigo, right? right? It's Daigo, you dude. Know. <laughs> Daigo doesn't deserve to get my real character yet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know. He's young. Right, yeah. <laughs> he may actually think that. <laughs> oh, great jump timings. Great anti-air timing, too. Daigo's still caught in the corner. Bad position for him. Oh, good job. Daigo wow, just gets sweep. out of the corner. Oh! Ooh. Ultra Combo says, no thanks on that overhead. I got you. Very good corner control. Mm -hmm. Daigo looked like he was making a comeback there. Let's see what adjustments he makes. I really like the Tiger Shot timings that Anikatu was using. Yeah, especially since New Sagai yeah, has great. a much larger delay on his Tiger Shots. Oh, great air to air. Uh, Daigo, okay, now Daigo trying to push into the corner, trying to get this. Lots of neutral jumps. Okay, as, see, as he's neutral jumping, he's doing a tatsu. You, very, you'll see it just a few frames. Uh -huh. But he's building meter. Right. Because meter is so important in this matchup. Yep. And, you know, he does it right before he lands or early just to avoid. Oh! He might have had an opportunity to uppercut there, but... Right. Okay, here comes Daigo now. Perfect spot for him. He gets the knockdown. Oh, this should be about it. Yep. Yeah. Good Only stuff. choice that Anakata had was to try to go for the super. He tried it, but the little charge-up time eats the opponent's inputs. You don't get the input, and it's really frustrating to deal with a lot of times as an ST player. I love the opening from Daigo this round. It was the same. It was red fireball. He got the knockdown, and all of this is because of that. Yep. Oh, wow. A little, beautiful. little bit misranged. Oh, and any, any reversal you can do, I can do better. Oh, oh that's it. Great read. Yeah, yeah doesn't good even bother game. with the super. I really like that last round from Daigo. Started off very intelligently. It was the same opening that he had the previous uh -huh. round, and I think maybe uh, Ultra Combo was looking for something different, but Daigo knew.